Okay. This is a little video for those who are, uh, those of you who survived the apocalypse. Um, that's just recently happened. Uh, I don't know if there's going to be another one, and uh, I wouldn't be too sure, but um, you know, needs must. So here we go. This is for the benefit of those who need to find out how we may have survived, whether there's anything we can learn from this, if there's any techniques or uh, foraging, for example, ability. But I'll start out by explaining a little bit about where we were when it all started. So I, I was at a bake sale down in uh, Bodnich and um, near Tiverdurn and uh, there there was a I remember distinctly I was I, I, I'd sold what four or five of my preserves I'd had a, had a couple of chutneys left and uh, I had quite a few pies left and uh, especially a, a lentil pie that I'd made uh, I was quite pleased with and a uh, message came on the radio, someone was listening to the radio on the stall next to me about um, apparently the uh, bottom just fell out of the uh, American dollar and uh, you know we all sort of thought well that's not such a big deal but apparently it was and uh, you know people started to sort of go mad all around the world but we carried on and you know I, I was quite pleased really because I, I you know nothing really happened in the bake sale and I carried on selling you know I sold another three preserves by the afternoon and and, uh, and, and, and I think I sold most nearly all my chutneys and uh, I thought well yeah um, and then someone came over to the stall and said Mandy listen you know the, the bottom's falling out of all money around the world what are we going to do I said, well, I guess we just carry on. So we carried on, but, you know, we didn't think much of it then. I mean, we thought, oh, they'll sort it out by the end of the week, you know. Uh, and they didn't, really. Um, what happened was, they sort of, as the week progressed, uh, the world just sort of descended into chaos then. And uh, people started out, well, apparently, I mean, it sort of might be hearsay, but many countries you know, experiencing the famine that they experienced in that first week was phenomenal and people apparently turned to cannibalism. Uh, I wouldn't condone that in any way, shape or form, but you know, if people are starving, you know, you got to forgive them a little bit of, of some, you know, from time to time. Uh, I wouldn't condone it, but uh, if it did happen, I can understand why they might have done it, but I, I'm not p best pleased, and I, you know, personally, I may do with what I could at that time. I, you know, I had, uh, had uh, well, I've still I'm down to the last quarter of my cottage pie, um, and I made various preserves over the summer that are still keeping me in good stead right now. So. Uh, I guess you could say I've done rather well out of it. I mean, I seem to be doing a lot better than than um, than my local community, which has, to a certain extent, seemed to uh, fall apart. And we're uh, what are we now? Possibly about three, four months in. Uh, well, no more than that. I don't. I can't remember really. Could be more, maybe half a year, nearly. It's been a long time. Um, and yeah. Uh, I'm still doing well, really. Oh, uh, oh that must be yeah. that must be Java. I'll just be back in a minute. Oh, Mandy, 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 you Mandy, 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 you know, a little something. Well, I could, I could possibly help you out with some cottage pie. I've got a little bit of cottage pie left, and I've got a nettle, um, a nettle pie as well. Oh, that would be great, Mandy. Thanks a lot. All right, I'll just, I'll just fish in the cupboard and see what I can get you. Then hang on. Oh, this is brilliant. <laughs> He's always popping round. 
Right, oh, there we go. Okay, I'll be with you there, Brian. Oh, I can't, Mandy. That's so fucking kind of you. Uh, uh, see you tomorrow, then, Mandy. Yeah, sure, Brian. Okay. You, you, uh, you watch your show, Mind how you go now. Okay, bye. Bye. Bye, Mandy. Right, so in the coming weeks, I think I'll be teaching those who survive a few of the techniques with what I've learned as I've sort of garnered the information, the know-how on how to survive during this here apocalypse and hopefully that will stand everyone else in good stead uh, as the uh, weeks and months go by and anyone that finds this video who survives and if I don't survive, you know, you never know uh, you might be able to use this video to help yourself survive. So, thanks very much.